Hey everyone, this is Alan from BMW Durham, back again with another video. We have another new arrival. It's the 2023 BMW X1 xDrive 28i in San Remo Green Metallic. Alright, so this is the 2023 BMW X1 xDrive 28i in San Remo Green Metallic. And uh, this one has the X-Line package on it, so there's a couple of different things here that are different than the M Sport model, which I've showcased both of them already on my channel, but this is the first time we've seen one here that is in San Remo Green, so I definitely wanted to spend some time and share this beautiful color with you. It's definitely unique and uh, definitely looks really awesome. And it's such a unique green because it's so dark. In some angles it definitely looks black, but uh, you can see it's definitely a green paint here. So what I want to do next is let's take a look at the closer details. All right, so we're at the front of the vehicle. I'm just going to press unlock so I can show you guys what that uh, welcoming animation looks like with the headlights. And I'm just going to press lock to show you that the lights uh, will also have an exiting animation as well. Uh, we've got to wait a little bit of time for it to happen. But anyway, we do have the inverted L-shape headlights, we have that one-piece kidney grill, and there's the exiting animation. So one-piece kidney grill looks really good with that uh, brushed aluminum. And then we've got uh, air ducts on either side here that go to the brakes. And we've got some brushed aluminum accents down here on the front, plate bracket. And overall, the car looks really awesome. Uh, I think I need to turn off that walk up walk away feature because the car keeps on locking and unlocking. Now we have non body colored uh, wheel arches here and here we have the 19 inch 867 wheels in uh, midnight gray burnished finish so that looks really nice and because this is the X line model so we've got this style of side skirt here with the brushed aluminum trim piece at the bottom. So we have the brushed aluminum window surrounds here. We have the brushed aluminum roof rails and we have the panoramic roof and we've got that new style antenna that we've been starting to see on some of the vehicles. And if we come all the way around to the side, we can see those nice body lines coming right into the tail lights and we do have this very aggressive sculpted rear tail light design here. And camera is just down here for the backup camera. X1, xDrive 28i, and because this is the X-Line model, you've got all this brushed aluminum on the bottom here, and no visible exhaust tips, but if we look underneath, you can see that it is a split dual exhaust underneath there, okay? So what I want to do next is let me just kick my foot underneath the vehicle, and that's going to have the tailgate open. Now I have uh, two strings hung up here so that I can have the cargo cover come out. And uh, we've got your carpeted floor mats here. There are four grocery bag hangers in the back here. We've got a little netted area on the side, 12 volt plug, space down here in the bottom. And if I lift this up, so this can normally stay up, but let me just move these mats out of the way so it can actually do it. Just like so. I put these back down there so lots of space down here and there's a little tire inflator kit there that has your wheel lock keys and your tow hook and let me just put this back down again we have a button up here to close another one to close and lock but I can kick my foot underneath the vehicle in order to have this close just like so Alright, so here is the illuminated uh, welcome light down here on the floor so reading BMW. I'm going to open up the rear door and we've got the black perforated Sensitec inside of here and uh, those are the winter floor mats. So this is what it looks like back here. All three of the headrests can flip up if somebody's sitting here but if nobody's sitting there you can flip them back down. You've got armrest in the center here with cup holders and the seats fold down in a 40-20-40 uh, split with these drawstrings at the bottom. So if I pull this, uh, let me just get the seat down one second. So just like so, seat will drop 
And if I lift it back up, there are three positions that it will lock in for recline. So just like that, and then just like that. Now up top, panoramic sunroof, lots of space here. We have some vents on the back of the center console, two USB type C charging ports, vents underneath the front seats, pockets on the side doors. Let's go take a look at the front. All right, so we have comfort access on the front door handle so we can lock or unlock by touch. And if I open that up, we've got your door handle here, speaker grills, aluminum BMW door sill. We've got power seats, so these ones are not the sport seats. And we do have a Sensatec dash with some nice stitching there. That looks really nice. And it looks like we've got some black trim inside of here. Uh, we've got your wireless charger as well as uh, your cup holders, two USB Type-C charging ports, 12 volt plug. We've got the new style uh, center console here that does not have the iDrive controller, but it is kind of like the iX style. If you press that, bit of space in there, and then there's uh, more space just underneath here as well. And if I open this up, it is uh, illuminated in that glove box. Let's go open the door on the driver's side. All right, so it says BMW down here as well. Let me open up the door. And right over here, we've got window controls, side mirror controls. We've got tailgate. We have uh, unlock lock, memory buttons. Same type of power seat controls that we've got on the other side, on the driver's side as well. And we have your iDrive 8 curved display. We've got that new style steering wheel, so X-Line model does not get any paddle shifters. And there's also no sport transmission mode in the non-M sport mode. You just have a low gear. We have your exterior lighting, turn signals that also acts as flash high beam, turn high beam on manually, cruise control. We've got volume up, volume down, voice commands, answer the phone. Pressing this makes the center control what mu uh, music you're listening to and pressing this makes the center change the layout and contents of your dash here. And uh, overall, it looks really nice in here, up top. I like the uh, frameless rear view mirrors that we've been having in our vehicles. And this one does not have the interior uh, camera, but you can get it in some other models. So let's go take a look under the hood. So I'm just gonna pull this twice, one, two. And if we pop the hood, so there we have it, that is the B48 2 liter inline four twin power turbo, 241 horsepower, 295 foot pounds of torque. Uh, we have your washer fluid, we have your positive battery terminal, and we have your negative battery terminal. Great little engine inside of here. All right, so I'm just gonna walk around this vehicle one more time just to try and give you as many wide angle views as I can. Car looks really good. I think this color is awesome. Um, I've only seen this color on a handful of different cars, but it is a pretty popular BMW color. Car looks really nice. You guys let me know what you think in the comments below. But overall, these X1s have become pretty popular and uh, I'm, I'm glad to see them showing up in abundance. All right, everyone, so that was my tour of this beautiful 2023 BMW X1 xDrive 28i in San Remo Green Metallic. Uh, if you guys like the car, if you guys like the video, if you guys like me, make sure you like, share, and subscribe. We'll see you on the next video. Thank you so much for watching.